What's up y'all, it's Paige Pierce. Welcome back to the channel. On today's video, I wanted to try something different. You guys always get to see what it's like during a round and maybe our thoughts before or after in the interviews, but you don't often get to see what a tournament's like behind the scenes. So in this video, I wanted to show you what is most people's favorite tournament, the Green Mountain Championships in Vermont. There's so much to do on and off the course, and I wanted to give you guys a little bit of insight on what goes on. All right, just got to Vermont. Thanks to Joe and Cam for driving the van all the way here. Straight from the airport, we're playing a practice round with the homies. We're doing a little double side action. I got Paul Oman. Call Paul. One of the ways that I like to practice for an event is to play a competition round. There's two ways that this benefits me. One is because it forces me to just focus on that one shot and I don't get a second chance. So I really focus in and come up with a game plan. Another reason is because there's something on the line and usually we play for lunch or something like that, but either way, whatever it is, putting something on the line makes it feel like you, you don't just give up. You're not just gonna just putt and putt and putt. You really have to keep trying and down into the last putt. favorite things to do on any given week is to check the internet and see what bands are playing in town and that is one of the coolest parts of disc golf tour is it aligns with a lot of musicians tours so we get to go check online and see who's playing and on this week I got to see my favorite band of all time Billy Strings and someone I've never seen before Willie Nelson so check this out after five hours yeah. some parking delays oh, Billy. We made it. we're up Billy I know that you guys know that a lot of pros have a van and they travel in the van, but I don't think you quite understand what van life is like. So this segment, I really wanted to show you guys what that means for us. Hey James, you wanna sub in for a crib game? Something cool that you can find at every Pro Tour event is like a, a village. You got a bunch of pros selling their discs, signing autographs, saying hi to the fans. You'll have a bunch of food trucks or food vendors. So after the round, the women can come, turn their cards in, get some food, set up. And before the round, the men can do the same. And then we can stay on site and really enjoy everything the tournament has to offer.
One of the greatest gifts that disc golf has given me has been a second family. You know, we talk about being on the road so often, missing home and missing our family, but luckily disc golf provides a second family. We obviously spend a lot of time together. We cook, clean, eat together all the time. We also can't get that competitive spirit out of us. It's not just on the disc golf course. So we play a lot of games, lots of board games, and our favorite is Catan. But we also like to just be outside, go hiking, go swimming, anything that just creates memories. This year in 2022, we were so lucky to have Corey Wong be a part of the Disc Golf Pro Tour community. He came on and played at five events, and then he also organized a bunch of other musicians to come play at our tournaments to try to bring people that love music into the sport of disc golf. This was to get new eyes into the sport, and I think it did just that. Here are some clips from the Fall Fest where Kevin Jones opened up for Corey Wong, and this is what blending the worlds of disc golf and music together looks like. Jumping in some cold ass water. Let's get this. <laughs> okay, earlier in the video, I told you guys that Green Mountain Championships was one of our favorite spots on tour, and I'm gonna show you why. There's so much nature, hiking trails, waterfalls, mountains, and this right here is called Bingham Falls. This is the go to spot for all the pros before or after their round. As you can see, a lot more things happen than just the disc golf on any given weekend on the Pro Tour. So if this doesn't inspire you to get out to a tournament and go check out what the vibe is like at a tournament, I don't know what else will. I hope you guys have a good holiday and I hope to see you at an event in 2023.